Hey everyone, we're here with Sophie Merce, who is the CEO of Novalash. I learned so much after attending your class. Um, one of the things I thought was the most unique about the Novalash education was the stress you put on using different lengths of the lashes. Right. Why is that? Well, it's really important when you're doing extensions that you follow the natural growth pattern of the hair. So our eyelashes naturally have a growing, a resting, and a shedding phase, just like the hair on our head does. And if you put long lashes on all of your natural lashes, number one, it kind of looks really artificial or almost looks like a clown, you know? Or um, the other problem is, is that they don't last as long if you don't match the right extension for the right natural lash. Okay, and then one last thing I wanna ask you is, tell us about the lash industry as a whole. Where do you see it going? How can this um, add additional profit to a professional's bottom line? Well, as far as profitability goes, the service is actually the most profitable beauty service of any service in the entire industry right now, and that's because it's a labor-intensive service, so it's it has a very high profit margin um, because the product does not cost a lot. Basically, the operator is just paying for about four drops of glue and just a few pinches of synthetic fibers. So people are charging around $250 for a full set and between you know anywhere from 50 to 175 for a fill. So basically, it's just whatever the operator wants to charge for their time, they can. Uh, and that gives you a huge margin. There are a lot of services out there that are sort of high-end services like hair extensions and things like that. The problem is um, that doesn't leave the operator with a whole lot of margin at the end of the day because the product is so expensive. But in this case, you have a high-end service that you can charge a lot for and the product is very inexpensive. So the lash category as a whole is growing. It has been growing exponentially ever since uh, I started Nova Lash in 2004. So people take the class, learn the skills, and make some more money.